You need to do laundry too, Cuff? Is it like, is Sunday like universal laundry night or something? Fuzzy Munka, thank you for the lurka. Oh shit, it's all like nighttime and fire now. Who needs close period when you, hey, ghost. Now we're talking. Now we are tuck tuck talking. If it's just looking, window shop away. Um. Do 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 do. Leaving so soon? Yes. Goodbye, Duke. I don't need clothes, but be real awkward walking around family naked. And yeah, maybe. Wear something, Cuff. Got a long way to go. Awkward for them. For you, you'd just be like, ah, whatever. Enjoy the show. Enjoy the show. <sighs> Only wears clothes during streams and when kids are here? Bro, you live in Alberta. That shit is cold. Oh, damn. Mythics with the 18 months of breaking limits. Here, get that quad cam stick spin action, Mythics. Thanks, bro. Thanks for the limit breaking. Thank you. Miranda thinks we're nothing but children. Oh, she doesn't care for us? No. She's long lost all her humanity. I must destroy her. I don't give a shit about your family drama. Imagine taking a shotgun to the face and surviving. Oh, you got me? I was in the military, I've showered with 60 other dudes. Nothing phases me anymore. That'll desensitize you for sure. That's a lot of dudes. Because it's snowed this weekend doesn't mean I need clothes. That shit is cold though. That's wild. Enjoyed the quad cam. Thanks, Mythics. Dicks. I've added a few little, dicks. little touches. People have dicks. dicks. It's true. Imagine being a doctor. You've seen it all when you're a doctor. Dicks. 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 Is this necessary? Dicks. God. Ah. <laughs> Why are what you do on your free time? None of my business. <laughs> Dicks. Ooh, what's this? A loke pig. Get that damn bright light out of my face. There's gotta be a... Uh... Oh, here we go. Oh no, we missed something along the way, guys. There's something in here still. That's the horny right there. You go arrest that horny... <laughs> For a second cuff, I thought Wyra put herself in horny jail. I was like, that seems appropriate. Right, we missed something. <clears throat> something somewhere. It's probably like 40 bucks. It's probably nothing worth running around looking for. But I'm gonna find it. 
Jeez, maybe I won't find it. Hmm. I broke it. Uh, there might be a cooldown on it or something. Alright, well I'm not seeing whatever it is that I'm missing here, so... We're just gonna move on from this area. Hopefully it's nothing important. Is there a cooldown on it? There must be. I think Stream Elements has like built-in cooldowns. Eighty-seven percent. Hot diggity damn. Hmm. Do we have a pipe bomb? I do have a pipe bomb. Money. There you go, ghost. It has been unveiled. Ghost is 24% horny. I expended more ammo than I wanted to. Uh, doing that. 240%? I mean, maybe. Shit. Another one. Um. Alrighty. What about me? Zero percent. Not even a little bit. Fuck. Oh god. I think I'm gonna die. I don't even have any heals. Fuck. What are you supposed to do about these guys? Gotta stop it oh shit, I don't think I should go up there. Alright, this might be a rip. Cause I don't fucking know what to do. Do I need to shoot that? Fuck. There we go. Okay. We'll restart that part. Yeah, you're practically asexual. Uh, I don't know about that. Just disinterested. Is he really though, or does he just not show it on stream? I don't, I don't, uh, define myself as that, as such. <clears throat> Enough about me. Alright, we need to hit all of those red thingies. Back to the horny mofos in chat. Precisely. I wonder, I don't really know how to deal with these guys. I know they have like a red thing on their chests, but I don't know if I need to be like shooting it or whatever. I guess I could maybe block. Jesus. Oh, 
I don't. I didn't grab the money. It's fine. Time of the horny corns. Is that like a unicorn, but a horny corn? Fuck. Excuse me. Oh my god, dude. These guys are fucking obnoxious. I hope my bed is still warm from doing laundry. Excuse me. Oh, so you can just shoot them in the chest. I just kept missing. That's the problem. I like a cool bed. Me too. Yeah, because then it warms up for me being in it anyways. Unless it's really cold. And a warm bed is really nice. Alright. We made it past that section. I'm really proud of us. Hmm, I can make five more heals. I meant recently slept in, not warm temp. I like really cold. I took a nap earlier and I left the window open. It's so cold. When you do that, it's nice. Except for spiders get in. Attach a jetpack and head stabilizers to a soldat. Greatly improves mobility. Experiments prove limited flight capabilities. No long distance flight, ter flight, but now possible to navigate rugged terrain. Attach aluminum alloy shielding to a soldat to protect chest reactor and exposed flesh. Experimentation proves he is invincible against regular firearms. Armor doesn't hold up against strong blasts. Further development needed. Fuck. Do I have to fight more of these things? I fucking hope not. No spiders for me. I have nice bug screens. Nice. I don't. I could use one. I could really use a... I could really use a bug screen. Thirty-three Celsius? Oh, that's so warm. That's crazy. My prediction is that Mia did all this because Ethan is special and has the power to lose limbs and stuff and put them back as well as Rose. Well, I think Mia is involved somehow. I think Chris was like, when he first shows up, I think he was there to like, assassinate Mia for whatever reason. But I don't know how she's involved. Yeah, I don't have a bug screen. I need to get one. It would be nice because then I could leave my windows open during the summer. But moths, like giant moths fly into my, my apartment. Yeah, so my theory is Mythics that Mia is involved somehow and she's not dead. I don't know just exactly how she's involved yet, but some involvement one way or another. I hate the weather here. Hot and sunny constantly gets old. Yeah, I could only imagine. Mia might be mother, mother, whatever her name is. Oh, shit. Yeah, I had that same suspicion. But I don't know, Mythics, if, if that's the case. It could be. It would be weird. Shit. That was close. Because, like, you have to be in two places at once, which is a superpower in, its, in itself. So I'm not sure. We have insanely huge mosquitoes here, so I must have a screen. Oh, God. Huge mosquitoes? Oh, hey. It's a fucking goat. <laughs> Yeah, count me out, giant mosquitoes. No, thank you. No bueno. No me gusta. They have put her together using the ritual, have to use for Rose, and they start praising her. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Let's, let's, let's find out. <laughs> like, I think I'm close to the end. I don't know exactly how close. What? How am I missing something in this area? It's a big empty room. 
It's a big ass empty room. How could I be missing something? I, I thought that initially too. I was watching someone else's playthrough and I was like, it was like early in their playthrough and I was like, I wonder if Mia's like mother, what is her name? Mother, whatever, mother something. I said I, I had the exact same prediction, so we'll see. We'll see if we're right, Mythics. That'd be really cool. Be a big twist. But then I'd have to fight her, maybe. I wonder if Duke's involved, too, somehow. I mean, Duke's like a sales guy and, and, and all that shit. He seems like a pretty good, cool bro, but I feel like he could be evil. What's this button do? Ethan needs to dump her. You mean divorce. They're married, Mythics. They're married. Whoa, baby. Eric Dragonheart. Welcome, dude. Soon, she'll start her ceremony with your rose. If that happens, it's all over. Not. For your kid. And for the whole village. <laughs> Not. But don't worry. I'll stop it. I'll use Rose. Mother Miranda. Miranda. Mother Miranda. <laughs> Poor Papa. You're the only one who doesn't see your kid's power. Shut up. Take Rose? <laughs> I'd like to see you try. How are you, Eric? What's good, bro? Happy Sunday. All right. They're giving us lots of ammo, so there's probably some sort of fight coming up soon. This is quite a large factory. It definitely doesn't look this big on the outside. Yeah, right? That's exactly what I'm thinking, Ethan. Like, who the fuck designed this place? I was the village. Oh, migraine? Shit, bro. Sorry, Eric. That is big sucky suck suck. Uh... Can I combine any of these items? I'm now- I'm calling it now. Miranda is 1000% Zoe. Wait, Eric, have you- did you watch- didn't you watch, uh, Huskin just finish this? A mold for creating a key using cast iron. A mold for creating a ball using cast iron. Zoe is Duke? Could be. I need a horse key. The fuck? You fell asleep. Well, having a migraine, I could see that. We think Miranda is Mia. We think Miranda's gonna be Mia. Oh, hey, Duke. What's up, bro? If it's just looking, window shop away. So he's definitely not involved at all. I thought about the cover-up about the I last game. It was interesting, actually, how they talk. You, Mr. Winters. Acted gas. Act gas. Might not. Lost some last. Last another hour? I might not last another hour. It is what it is, Eric. If you gotta if you gotta duck out and get some shut eye, dude. Do that. It's whatever's best for you, man. Whatever's best for you. Do we even want any of this shit? Food is life. Food is life. Aha. Uh, I can't afford it. Well, let's sell some of our shit. And buy it I will. Mm, yeah, we're gonna get the power upgrade for the sniper rifle. Damn, they give you a lot of, uh... I thought I upgraded this to full. Maybe not. Have a wonderful adventure. But the gas leaks and stuff. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I don't entirely remember that. 
it, it's been three years now since I played Resident Evil 7, and I'm highly debating playing through it again. After playing this, I just kind of want to play it again. Because I have the PC version now, because it came with this. Uh, so we need something, something, something with something. We're missing something along the way here. I need to make a key. Looks like I can drop down here. There was a note in the beginning of this game talking about the people in Louisiana from Res 7. They all died from a gas leak in pipes, but it was a cover-up about what happened. Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. Um, I thought maybe, yeah. No, I do remember that now that you mentioned that, yeah. Yeah, and uh, Ethan's like, wow, I can't believe they've just forgotten about it already. All of it. They just brushed the whole incident under the table like it was nothing. <laughs> What's this? More money. Wait. That didn't take us where I'd hope it would take us. There's something else in this room. It was nice that they actually gave us some like closure on Resident Evil 7 as well. All right, well, I don't have to go back down. I just need something, this fucking horse key. They wouldn't make me go all the way back down, would they? Or can I take that, can, is this an elevator now? Does this act like an elevator? So I can go back to the lower floor? Oh shit, it does. Alrighty then. I have to go back down? Shit. That's the big, big boar. Alright, well we'll save before we do this. I was hoping I didn't have to go back down, but we're gonna go back down. Uh. Yep. At least he's on an industrial lift, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, we might be pushing uh, weight capacity there, even, even still. What's up, Darkon? Fuck these guys. I don't know if I'm right, but I feel like Duke gets fatter through the game every time you see more of his stomach further in the game. Maybe. Maybe he just eats. We don't know what he does when we're not when we're not staring at him. He ate Rose. Gross. That's messed up. Rose is in the jars. We're gonna bring back Rose. How do I get to the... Now I have to remember. I have to remember how to get back to the, uh... The mold? Not here. Looks like his eating habit is a really big problem. Not for me. Jesus. They explode. Alright, so you can kill those things. What up, Josh? How's it going, my dude? You really drilled that guy. Damn, right... Right into the dad jokes. Right into the buns. Right down to business. I like it.
Ugh, I don't remember how to get back to where I'm trying to get to you. Is it this way? Doing some farming, half listening, nice. How far are you on your, uh, on your solo farm now? Alright, well, we might have to come back here. Maybe? Is it even further down? Oh shit. Yeah. Superman. Actually loaded Neo 2 for the first time in a few months. Apparently I'm in a dream of the demon difficulty and still not worried about anything killing me. What level are you? Cruising halfway through winter? 120k in the bank? Holy shit. You're freaking rich. No, I think I've gone too far. I think I've gone too far, guys. I need to go back up. My man Josh is loaded. That's a lot of cows. 324. Um, I think I'm level 80, somewhere around there now, Darkon. I put Neo 2 on hold for now just because I really wanted to play this. I'll be back at it eventually. I'm going to be doing some like more variety over the next little while. I'll probably be playing like, there's a few game, different games I want to be playing, but uh, I'm going to try and space it out appropriately. Nope. Under 300 deaths? Holy god. I'm well over that already. Uh, where is it? Isn't the mold on this level? Ah! That's impressive, Darkon. Oh, I see it. I just don't know how to get over there. This place is a maze, so... Bear with me while I'm just wandering around lost. Maybe down to the next floor. I think this is the right way. Isn't it? Is there a point to the bobbleheads on the end of the guns? Uh, no, they're just like gun charms. They're just like bonuses for pre-ordering. Cheeky my breaky. Cheeky my breaky. What's up, GB? No! Leave me alone! How's it going, GB?
Ah, fuck. Ow, fuck. Ah. Jesus. Shit. Oh, this guy's one is on his back. What fuck that scared me I'm trying to make this video but feel bad about making this video But feel like I shouldn't make this video because this whole situation is fucked up <laughs> Jesus isn't here. No, he is not Eric No, he is not I think it's up top here. I Don't know where the freaking foundry is anymore. I totally forget Uh, yes, this way. Jesus can't help you here. I like sweaty builds. That's true. That's very true. Nope, not this way. Man, oh man. Not this way. Downstairs? I'm gonna find it by accident eventually. Fuck off. Fucking hate those guys. <laughs> Alrighty. Here it is. Uh, we need the key mold. As long as your character doesn't have to count to nine, you should be fine. I hope I don't have to do that either. I'm not good at counting. Heisenberg's key, nice. That is indeed one of the things that we needed. Mm -hmm. Have you played Resident Evil before, Darkon? Oh my god, we did it finally. All right, let's go run up here real quick because I think there is a thing Maybe One of these things is gonna jump up and come to life Fuck I played through seven and the older ones with the tank controls. Oh, nice. Yeah, I haven't. I've only played Resident Evil. Um, like as far as the originals go, I've only played uh, three and one a little bit. God, there goes all my shotgun ammo. Seven is very good. Yeah, seven. Seven was awesome. I really enjoyed it. And this is a direct sequel to 7. Which is fucking great. 
What's that? Oh, shit, nice! Got the long barrel. If you happen to finish this game early and want to experience real fear, let me know. Um, what you got in mind? All right, so I'm gonna try and get to Heisenberg's quarters because there's probably something good in there. Oh, Tarkov? Uh, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh no, trust me, Tarkov is scary no matter what, Darkon. It's scary no matter what. Hello everyone. Pipe bomb these fucks. Scariest game I've ever played. Yeah, I've had more jump scares in Tarkov than any other game. That's for sure. Something else in here. It's gotta be something really good in Heisenberg's quarters, or else what's the freaking point? Oh, here we go. Mechanical part shaft. Huh? Oh, I bet I'm gonna need that for something. Mechanical part shaft. It's probably just something I can sell. Yeah, it's pretty it's a pretty scary game. That's for sure. Alright, uh This way LS had a few decent dump scares, but only because you can't fight back. All you can do is run for your life. That's true, and I actually really like I like LS. The first playthrough though was the only scary time. After you've played it once. It kind of loses all of its uh, all of its scare factor because you know where all the scary parts are and you know the mechanics of the game. But up until you know, the first playthrough is a hell of a ride for sure. First time through LS, I was shitting my pants. Now I have to remember how to get back. This is fun. That's the issue with most scary non-roguelikes. Is that you know where all the scary parts are, you know when they're coming. Dead Space 2 scared me as a kid, I remember. The Undying. I don't know if I ever played The Undying. It doesn't even ring a bell. This way. This is the way we want to go. I just played Dead Space 2, like, in January. Oh, fuck. And it was scary. Well, it wasn't that scary, but it, it had, like, a lot of, like... Like, stuff is constantly jumping out at you in that game. It's just like, God damn it! Leave me alone! I don't remember where to go from here. We'll run around until we figure it out. Is this not the way? No, that's not the way. Where? 
Where do I go? Hmm. Oh god. Excuse me, sir. I would like to live today. Watching you play Dead Space 2 was very fun. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed that, Jeff. You were the one that got me to play it. It's terrifying. Oh no, I'm back here. Shit. It wasn't supposed to be like this. supposed to be this way oh I don't think it's this way a good person good first person survival horror roguelike could be fun I guess there's not really any games that are that qualify as that is there I can't really nothing really comes to mind that fits fits all of those genres Oh man, I'm so lost now. I just don't remember how I got in here. Let's try going this way. Hmm, Minecraft? For me, Minecraft doesn't really seem like it would be a defining scary game. I don't have the ammo to fight my way out of here anymore. I don't find games too scary anymore unless I have to grind for hours and shit and have my asshole clenched to a gun that was like an hour of my time. And I'm scared. I'm scared of a lot. Okay, that's just a circle? So that's not the way. That goes to Heisenberg's quarters. It's gotta be this way where this bad guy is. Fuck him. Is he just gonna chase me around? I just feel a little too detached due to how clunky the graphics are. I never, w I never played Minecraft before. Bro, you need to chill. You never had a creeper explode behind you with diamonds in a cave. That's true. Yeah, I don't know the stakes of Minecraft. I don't know the stakes. It's either, I think it's up this way. I hope I'm right. I have a hard time being scared of squares. That's an interesting way to put it. Ooh, money? Trust me, Zach. I'm doing a lot of running. Just trying to figure out where the heck to go. Okay, I think I'm in the right area. Because there's the generator. Bed frames? Bed frames are scary. Is it this way?
This place is a horrible maze. I hate it. Do 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 do. It must be this way. Why do bed frames scare you, GB? Eternal Darkness had a fun way of scaring you back in the GameCube days. Oh, I remember Eternal Darkness. Did I ever beat Eternal Darkness? No. But I remember it. This is where this guy is. This is back the way I just came? Oh no. Ah! Fuck, that sucks. Can we make shotgun ammo? We're going the right way. Oh Jesus, really? Fuck, I should probably block. Fuck, man. I finally figured out where to go. Now there's like... <laughs> two drill guys sandwiching me. Fucking hell. It was a good time right there. It Chapter 2 wasn't as good as the first. It scared me as a kid so badly that I... Hey, bed frames. I'm so stretched out. I didn't even see the new It 2 movie. I love the first one. It's decent, just a little long. It pushes like three hours, I think. Length is never a problem if it's all good. Ah, yes, yes. I saw the first of the new ones. That's all I've seen, though. I don't think I saw the, <laughs> the follow up to it. Oh, man. Nothing's going to help me there. Got double trained, penetrated by two drill guys. Sounds like a fun night. Yeah, not what I had in mind for my, uh... Not what I had in mind for my, uh... Sunday night, but here we are. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Shut up. I need more shotgun ammo. Give me shotgun ammo and then we'll talk. Ever tried shooting the Duke? It uh, it doesn't let you shoot at him. You can't actually shoot at him. I did try though. I tried. Naturally, I had to see. Is it down? Ooh, a thousand chips. Hey, Wyra or Eric, are you guys here by any chance? If not, I got you, Zach. Uh, we gotta go do the labyrinth, because there's probably something good there. I can't believe I'm completely out of shotgun ammo from that section. Um, 
Oh, you know what? I'm so dumb. I never actually grabbed the ball. That's a rip. I guess we're not doing that. I got you, Zach. Ba ba da do ba ba da bo. <laughs> oh, hey guys, it's okay. I got it. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I got it. Oh wait, shit. That's supposed to be that's supposed to be another. It didn't even work because I fucking typed it in wrong, anyways. This is the only one thing that I don't have a quality of life for. There you go, Zach. The sooner laundry gets started, the sooner laundry gets done. I understand that, that premise. All right, I don't like the factory, but we're almost done, I think. We've arrived at Heisenberg. Watch there be like, a whole nother floor. You yeah, alright, Duke? Uh, I guess we're gonna have to shortcut this for now. Until I get more shotgun ammo. Used a cheap turboprop engine, but he's impossible to control. All he does is charge too much power output from the reactor. Completely invincible head on. The dumbass managed to chop his own damn arms off on the propeller. Also, issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Complete failure. Time to die. You can hear it, can't you? Yeah, I got oh. petted. Yay! You've made Zack very happy, Wyra. I can almost hear his tail wagging from here. Jeez, damn, I said the same thing, Mythics. I was like... Heisenberg kind of is like... A little bit like Lucas, but different. Whoa, shit. I don't have time for this bullshit. Out of my way! Excuse me. Fuck. Oh, I actually have to kill this guy. Runs up the sky and humps his leg. Oh lordy no! Where are you going bud? I'm over here. He's on fire. That shit's that not enough. Oh shit. Shit. Fuck, I missed. I got an idea.
fuck? Alright. Not a fan of that guy. Fuck, me neither. <laughs> fuck, I'm like stuck in his fan. There's gotta be a better way to deal with this guy. I'm, I should be dead. How are you not dead? Fuck. I can't believe he's not dead. Fuck! I can't believe this guy's not dead yet. Hi, Miss Mio. Hello, hello. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Uh, I'm doing all right. <laughs> I'm dealing with this horrible, horrible boss. Fuck. Oh my god. I just want to die so I can retry this. And not lose like all of my healing powers. I, ho I hope you're dead. Oh my word. Complex mechanical heart? Nice. Going okay, Miss Mio. I uh I just used the last of my healing though. I'm off to bed and have a good one. Alright, Eric. Hope you feel better tomorrow, dude. Sorry about the migraine. That is a big suck. Okay, I'm I'm gonna like end up soft locking the game for myself if I can't get access to more heals. Maybe I should double back. I don't know what to do here. If I'm out of heals, I'm out of heals. It'll be tough, but we'll figure it out. Emblem. My complex mechanical heart will always be yours, Sky. My complex mechanical heart will always be yours, Sky. That's the nicest thing anyone said to me all month. Thank you, Jeff. Have a good sleep, Eric. Miranda is... Abom abominable. Her deceit knows no bounds. Or merely a bunch of failed could do experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other people schmucks in the village. Though she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body, she took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She could turn to anyone using the Mega Myset Myseat? Mega Myseat? The trick is that brat Rose. If I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, the kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. Yeah, it's true. Ethan does just like. My penis gets sweaty when I see you. Oh. That's nice. Why? Well, I, I always thought something was up with Ethan. Like, he's not. There's no way, like, you can just reattach your arm like he did. 
pour some freaking water on it and be good to go. There's no way. There's just... It, it, it doesn't make sense. Alright, that shotgun is shitty. I want my other shotgun back. <laughs> that's nice. Well, that's nice. That's... That's something, isn't it, GB? That's just something. I found a goat. what I have to deal with, Miss Mio. Alright, here we go! Fun fact, somebody's already done a knife run only speed run with no healing. Already. In like two and a half hours. Like basically almost a world record. That's freaking crazy. That's some next level gamer shit. nothing in here so what the <sighs> fuck we have to fight Heisenberg with like no heals this is gonna suck ass not bad not bad you're, you're persistent but I've got a rebellion so stay out of my <laughs> pop, pop. Oh, my God. This is going to get rough. Yeah. That was a pretty good fall. Not bad. That bastard. All the way back to the bottom. Again? All right, let's start our second climb. Maybe he'll be nice and come down here and fight us. That would be nice. I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the True. way. He did say what that. Do you care, Chris. You killed my wife, you son of a bitch. You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! I'd give it about Why 8 out of 10. Tell me right away. The fall? Because yeah. I knew you would want to be involved. Dicks. This job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Hand me that wrench.
Am I gonna use this weapon to? Am I gonna drive that thing? Short. Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks. This is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold, like Louisiana. God damn it! All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. That might not be true. Take a look at this. Yeah, technically, yeah. I meant yeah. pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda, keep looking. What's up, Jason? Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go. Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get anything. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. Thanks for the host, Jay. Take that elevator. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight, we will. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead woman. All right, Ethan. Then you take this. And do me a favor. I'm gonna drive this thing? Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I'll stay under the radar with this giant fucking robot. Can't turn back now. Alright. Yeah, that's a super low profile makeshift tank. No problem. Super the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments. It supports our previous theories. She seems to have infected herself with the mutamycete, however you say that, which has granted her a number of abilities, included mimicry. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like any anyone or anything. Wait, maybe Miranda is Chris here in this situation. Disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winter's home. Objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. We attacked to put a little damper on her plan, so she mimicked a corpse. She then revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had original we had her way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found out something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around, even made from a metal polymer. Composite, which you can't control. Time to turn the tables. Okay. Okay. Oh, good. I got some first aid. We can, uh, we can justify this heal now. Uh, maybe make another one. We got two heals. That's all we got. Duke equals Mother Miranda. I mean, that would make sense. Seeing as how Duke gets around so easily. He does seemingly just like bounce around from all over the place. Could have been Mother Miranda all along. Are we driving this thing? Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with fire. Okay, this should be fun. <laughs> I'm coming. What the fuck is this thing? Nice, Miss Mio. Duke is like Granny? Um, uh, maybe. Oh, you can guard with the chainsaw? Dude, I want one of these things. Maybe. The kind of like unassuming, like, 
boss lord. Nah, I think Duke's a good guy. Sort of. Can probably blast the gate open. Probably. What the fuck is this game? This is kind of ridiculous, but I love it. Are you not dead yet? I'm tired of my shit too. Oh shit. Am I supposed to fight here? Like Jesus. All right, maybe grenade launcher. <laughs> yes, go. I'm having a blast. That do the trick. How are you not dead, sir? You really should have taken my deal. Nah, it's fine. Oh, that's convenient.
Iron Giant down. Fuck yeah. Ethan? I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Wait there, you hear me? Ethan? Rose? Ethan! Ethan, respond! Mia? What? Our child. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg gone, no boy, no. Lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? So I wonder where Mia Rose is. Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. Oh, she crazy. will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! I guess so, Mythics? I don't know where the swap happened. Calm yourself. Rose will be safe. I'm wondering where Mia is or if she's dead. Catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself. Why did Rose come to be? Was it because of her parents? And you are truly a special case. Oh, she was the witch. But I've learned all I can from your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda, you coward. Come on and face me. Oh. Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. Did you just rip out my heart? I will what make sure fuck? to sample your blood for later. Ethan ain't coming back from that. <laughs> Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> just, I'll take that, just shove it back in his chest. I've waited so long. The dreams really can. Or not, I can't wait to see my true child again. Huh. I wonder if she has her own area that I have to go to. Captain, but I'm dead. <laughs> I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? <laughs> Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle... They were riding. Oh, yeah, we tight. can do a raffle, Miss Meal. Let's do it. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not going to get away with it. Huh? So are we going to play God Chris now? It, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. We'll get her, Captain. The squad's ready for you.
I'm interested to see how they're gonna wrap this all up. This is any time. This is very peculiar. No, it doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what That's you can. That's off to Ethan. Roger he had a hell of a life. Been a while since we fought together, Captain. Med injector. Combat knife. Actually, I'm going to make, uh, that's going to be one. That's going to be me out of shape. three, two, two. But thanks right. to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turned herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at either. Spooky. Holy shit. Hey, Alpha. Oh shit. Christ. It looks pretty rough down there. How are you planning on reaching the objective? First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. I've got your back, boss. Let's get to work. Everyone watch for hostile bioweapons. Roger. Made contact with a group of hostile bioweapons. There's more than we thought. Watch out. And Resident Evil becomes a full-on shooter. Western route is clear, moving out. Roger that. BSAA craft spotted. Two guards. I doubt I need to like uh, worry about collecting items or anything. Oh, well, never mind. I take it back. Oh yeah, get in there, Josh. Get in there. Damn, Jeff. Good job, dude. Hey, boss, it's me. I'm at the location preparing for support fire. I Very rigged. Roger. Very rigged. Tundra here. Leaving some supplies in one of the houses, Captain. Help yourself. Keep shooting that thing. Yeti keeps coming at you. you. Keep shooting that thing. Yeti keeps coming at you. Yeti keeps coming at you. Okay, there it is. It's not a yeti. It's a werewolf. That's why your joke doesn't work. <laughs> Try to ride it. I mean, I'm down. 
They took away a lot of my uh, my functionable keys, like my map. Take that. Oh, hello. I would love to ride it though. That'd be real cool. I've never heard of a mutamycete colony growing so huge. Ouch. It. Shoot me again. Hey, there we go. I wanted to get the achievement for that. Well, I had an opportunity. Yeah, it's only first person. Josh, I can't believe you haven't played Resident Evil 7. That's like my one of my favorite Resident Evils. You should really play that game. You should definitely play that game at some point. Motherfucker! Ah! Shit balls! Seven is like totally different. This kind of looks like COD Zombies. Yeah, this part's a little bit weird. This is this is a bit more of a full-blown shooter uh, now, but it's only because of the way the story went. Well, Res 7 has some really good puzzles. God, Zombies is pretty fun, though. It is fun. Yeah. True. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Roger that, boss. Uh, destroy the giant mold construct? Sure. Let's do that. Res 7 is really good. It's almost like a little bit like... Uh, just Texas Chainsaw Massacre or something, but with a Resident Evil spin on it. Fuck. Okay, Captain. Fuck. I'm not ready. I got like. 15 zombies on me. Or lichens, rather. It's a lot. So you're liking this game then? It's pretty good, yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool. I would describe it as a cool game. I'm 
I don't know about this part yet. It's pretty intense. Like, definitely a change of pace. Murdering all of these lichens. As Chris Redfield. Not an, not what I was expecting, but... I, I, I like Ethan. I think Ethan is awesome. Fuck this. I'm just going to blow it up. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty cool. This part's a little bit intense. I wasn't expecting this, but I found a way down. It's fine. I'm going in. The rest <laughs> of you stay back. I'm having a good time. Captain, <laughs> murdering I'm everything. The village with a sample from the bakers, and uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. <sighs> stuff originated here. So, the, the events in Louisiana were all because of Miranda. Alright, Bish, I'm here. Guarding the Megamycete, huh? Oh, not this guy. Now we need some doom music. Now's a good time for some doom music. Oh shit, he's got armor on the front. You like that? Huh? You're fucked, bro. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please let me around you. Ouch. Oi. Thank you, Jeff. Hit him with it. Hold your horses and read on me. He's just like He's just like Oh, is he dead? Nice. I'll Resident going. Souls. The rest of you stay above Brown. Resident Eternal. Well, that was pretty cool. I'm assuming that guy's actually dead. Does night vision actually make that sound so when you Miranda put it on? Was the fake Mia. Where's the real one? I doubt she saw any further use for her. Freaking Dark Souls boss? Yeah. This. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? That guy, I had to fight him earlier as Ethan. Can figure it was that out later. Pretty insane, Focus honestly. I found it. I used like it's every resource. My oh my good lord! What the fuck? Oh, 
Alpha squad. That's a baby. I've located the Megamycete. This is how babies are made. We can end this mess after all. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. That last I'm part was heart-wrenching. Ethan dying? I'm going in. Roger that. I'm not by. convinced that he's dead, even though his heart Captain, was removed from his I chest. Eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. What's up, spammer? I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. Heart-wrenching. It wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even oh, so, you guys. <laughs> you should have told him. Yeah. Yeah, this game's a lot more action heavy than Resident Evil 7. Like, a lot more. Mmm, yummy. This must be Miranda's lab. What do I do with these books? Do I just look at them? So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Down, down, down. I think they can revive them with the same ritual they're trying to use for Rose. It makes the game said they wanted this Resident Evil to be less scary. Like 7, more action and shooter heavy. But they do deliver some really good horror. Um, Spencer, here. In some no. sections of the game, for sure. No like, really good horror. Those books contain info on the bosses. Can I open them up? My deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor, half-dead medical student in the snow. I've always cherished the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. I was inspired by your research to think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism. Positively visionary. I knew that with the knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusp of another, my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, though, that many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared, that your conviction differed from mine. Your hope to bring back a single dead person while aimed to change the world. Your experiments on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for, reminis my apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I found the key to evolution, the progenitor, a virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus research. I will call it Umbrella, just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I'm one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday, too. Oh, so this is all before. This is all beforehand. You taught me so much, and for that, I will forever be in your debt. Spencer Oswell. Wait, this is all before? The events of uh, the other Resident Evils? Oops. Or is that just an old note? Wait, so you can open the books? How do I fucking open them? How does one? Oh, there we go. Ah. Generation rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal any external wound within seconds and grow nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. Hereditary blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regeneration properties, also known as a vampire. Expect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced, she may mutate uncontrollably. Like when I fucked her up with that dagger. Is Moreau? Kadu has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them into organs similar to like fish-like gills and a swim bladder. 
Subject with a regular cell division causing him to transform into a giant fish. Subject is unable to control this transformation. In the beginning, they talked about moving to England to get away from what happened. Makes sense. So that's, that note was down here for a while then. But Spencer Oswell is the, the guy who started Umbrella though, right? It's been hundreds of years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then. I could bring you back to life from the Mega My CD. I had to test your new vessel's regenerative abilities. I took her apart and revived her in the Mega My CD. Regulator of the Giant's Chalice. All that is left to merge her body with the Mega My CD. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I wanted to be with you again, and that's when I found it. The Mega My CD. Completely by accident. I touched the black substance. My mind was overcome with knowledge. The Mega Mice breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew if that your consciousness was in there, too, then there would be a way to bring you back. When I returned to the village, I implanted the village with the mold from the Mega Sighty. That way I could control them, experiment on them. I have experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I haven't tried to increase the efficiency of finding a vessel creating a parasite called Kadu. None of my experiments came to fruition. There were some, like Alcina, were close to being perfect, but most turned into lichens. I was approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA. All they created was another defect, Evelyn. They again, then again, not a complete failure. I learned of Rose thanks to them. I knew she would be the perfect vessel. There was some interference, but I was able to verify her suitability, and my research is finally complete. Eva, I have waited too long to see you again. Wait, so Evelyn was a vessel for Eva? So even before that... Oh, hey, what's up, Kimar? So it goes back even further. That's crazy. How far back does it go? I mean, based on the fact that they're living in a castle, it must go back like 40, 50 years. 60 years. This game has Koroks. There's no Koroks in this one, Kimar. I'm... That sound just scared the hell out of me. It's the, uh, that's the Koroks from uh, Breath of the Wild. Show me your hands. Was Mia? Um, Bryce, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right it's now? It's not Mia. That's Evelyn, right? Stop or Eva. Or no, it's Mia. Four months. Uh, wow, four wow, months. wow, 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 wow. Thank you, Mr. Burrito. Thank you, Dan. You. Why are yeah, that's, here? yeah, that's Mia. I thought it was somebody else at first. In Houston experiments. How long has she been here? Did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Find all the seeds. Yeah, the going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm Four months of breaking limits. Side. Wait. Thank you, Dan. You can't leave Thank me you, here. You promised, damn it. Doggo dance. Doggo dance. You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me. Where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is... is gone. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. Come on. Yeah, I guess they've been, like, experimenting on Mia down here. What do you mean he's gone? It's probably pretty fucked up. He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No. Is he though? You're wrong. Is he dead? I tried to keep this a secret, but I feel like Ethan has those regenerative properties. You don't understand how special he is. Tell us. Tell us, Mia!
Oh shit, it's my boy Ethan. He's so special. How are you, Dan? What's going on? <laughs> so it's there. I'm special. It's cold. That's good. Better than being not special. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. Making some soju? Shit! What's that? <laughs> Yogurt soju equals best flavor. So it's like a drink? You're so dumb. What did you say? Is that e That's Evelyn. How are you here? I wonder. Dead. Am I dead? I dead, mean, dead? Miranda. She. No. I still have to save Rose. Rose? It wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. Ooh. What are you saying? I can still. See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? I mean, we all thought it was weird, Evelyn. equivalent of sake except it's then distilled to a spirit you died 12 to 50 percent three years ago that, that's that's impossible no actually way. now that you mentioned i think i have heard of it uh dan you shouldn't even be able to walk around quit messing with my head you shouldn't be walking screw you what? What am I? I, I? I? I did all that. Hey, he's got his fingers back on his left hand. Rose, Mia, I. Time? See your family again. Family. Family. No. Rose. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. Dead. <laughs> I, I will save Rose. Comes in all sorts of fruit flavors. It tastes like cider, except strong. Nice. Is it expensive? I'll save you no matter what. Mia was only in it for the mold. They made a mold baby. Did Ethan procreate with Miranda or At Mia, last, though? He awakes. Who did he have the baby with? Where am I? Miranda I infiltrated the home to kidnap Rose, so they had the baby on their own. But some at some point, Mia was swapped out. Duke, 
Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Procreate. Duke, I need a favor. In this case, it's a good choice of word. Take me to Miranda. I assume this much and I'm already on the way. We should arrive shortly. Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, are you sure of this? Your body is, well, falling apart. How much liquid you're getting, it's best to sip slow. Uh, yes. Supported from Korea. Foolish of me to ask. Makes sense why it's a little bit more pricey. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. Tell me. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? Why am I too dead? You gonna uh, die? I hope not. Yeah. I have Old has be. sperm. I knew I should have paid attention from bio. <laughs> I gotta go. Oh shit, I got all my weapons. Wait, am I allowed to freely wander again? I need to go this way. Excuse me, fine sirs. <laughs> Mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> y equals MX plus B. Was that Chris? I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take Pyth away from Pythagorean me. theorem? Pythagoras theorem? I will take what is due. I probably don't even remember My how to do that shit anymore. Will be no. Rose is mine! Time for bed. Good night, all. Good night, Miss Mio. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, did she just kill me? Wonderful father. Till now, of course. 
no problem, Miss Mio. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you enjoyed watching uh, the end game Resident Evil Village stuff. I just died so fast. Ah, uh, little Ava, my beautiful daughter. Skip. You fulfilled your purpose, soldiers. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Megamite. I saved my Magnum specifically for this shit. I assure you I'll provide her with truth. So now you can die peacefully. You understand the level of the not let you get away. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn The Metamice saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendid power. Yeah, right. You don't want to mess with the revolver. Oh, I don't think that shot counted. Whoa. Oh shit, I'm blind? <laughs> now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my house. The hell I will! Die, 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 die! <laughs> I will take back my daughter! <laughs> I understand your feelings. That revolver is kind of cheats. Uh, it's pretty powerful. I just didn't use any shots from it. I saved like. I think I used like maybe four shots in the entire playthrough. Saved it all for the end boss. <laughs> It'd suck if I didn't have it, probably. I'll figure it out though. I've never seen a human live without his heart. Are you sure you're Oh shit. Why do you need to feel sure? We might need a. I got a heal. I'm gonna make. I don't have enough to make more. She's my goddamn daughter, you psycho! Please, Mr. Winters, stop struggling. Ammo hoarding done right, exactly. I shall finish this. Curse this ram shack. Where the hell is she? <laughs> oh, fuck. This is... Oh, no, I don't have any more heals Those after this. Storms. They could do nothing to assuage my years of loneliness. Ever think the problem might be you, Miranda? You're not capable of real love. Your life is a world. Oh dear. I'm gonna die. Shit, I got nothing to heal with, actually. I got no heals at all? Fuck. I got no heals. Shoot. Shoot. The thing I didn't hoard enough of was healing. Unfortunately, this is going to be rough. Ah, little Ava, my beautiful daughter. Come to me. Rip. Yeah, I didn't. Yeah.
It's okay. We'll be fine. You fulfilled your purpose. Uh, maybe. I might be able to go back and get more heals. My false children and awakened the glorious Megamites. Now, please do not worry for little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with two hands. We'll just dump as much shotgun ammo as we can. You understand the level of the not let me break. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn kid? Try and block as much as I can. The Metamycete saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this. Lots of blocking. Lots of blocking. That's the trick. And then we'll try and finish with the revolver. She didn't like that. <laughs> now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my hands. Go on, rest now. The hell I will! I will take back my daughter! Nope, <laughs> missed me again. Do I have to hit her while she's in this state? I understand your feelings, Mr. Winters. True. But this is the for you. If I combine Rose with a Mega Mycet, my daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. A century. <laughs> I've got a lot of shots oh, left, actually, with this fucking thing. We should be able to finish her. If I don't miss too much. Such vitality. Oh. Why do you interfere? Surely you have no need for this now. So Ow. close to death. She's my goddamn daughter, you psycho. Oh no, I missed. Oh no, I accidentally shot. Fuck. I will see my I'm messing this up so hard. Must. One shot left with that. Ow. I'm taking a lot less damage than I did the None first first run. So I think we got this in the bag. Oh, force cutscene. All right. Yeah, thanks to that revolver. I, I was a little worried. I missed like four revolver shots or three revolver shots. That's it for you, bitch. <laughs> GG easy. Rose. Shh. It's it's all right, Rose. It's all right. So technically Mia's okay too. 
Oh. Uh oh. Ethan. Ethan. Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan. Wake up. Oh no. Chris. Ethan. You did it. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan. We gotta move. <laughs> what the fuck is that thing? Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. <laughs> Demogorgon. Damn it. We just wait for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Well, I'm... I was thinking, like, I'm thanks so for the sorry. host fault. I was thinking, like, there must be some sort of, like, giant Chris, super hey, monster hey. that's, like, the size of the entire sky because... Well, in comparison, Mother Miranda was actually quite a small bot looking boss. Can you tell yourself? <laughs> this well, isn't in my final further. form. <laughs> Hi, Vault. Watch over. <laughs> Teach her to be strong. Goodbye, Rosemary. Ah. Ethan. <laughs> Kmar. Thank you for the sixteen months of breaking limits, Kmar. Thank you. That's a big baby. That's a big baby right there. Boom. <laughs> hype! Hype, 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 hype! Go! Go! Take us up now! Well, I guess Mia already thought that Ethan was dead, but... Moving. We have to get clear. No, we can't go. Not without my husband. Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. I know he wouldn't abandon us. Tell me what's going on. Where? Uh, boom. I told you to sit down. <gasps> Gonna become part of all the mold. Where is he? I wonder if they ever do a Res 9, how they're gonna... If they're gonna bring what Ethan back as a character. Or maybe you'll play as Chris right. Redfield. I fucking have no idea. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. <laughs> Captain. You need to see this. BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bio weapon. The hell were they thinking? What's up, Zay? How's it going, man? Orders, Captain. Pick up the rest of the squad. What's the BSAA the again? BSAA Europe HQ. Oh shit! So okay, so shit's going down in you. Somewhere in Europe now. The BSAA has bioweapons. 
Chris has lost weight. Actually, in the beginning, everyone was like, whoa, Chris be thick. What the shit? Wow. It was quite an ending. Compared to RE60 is tiny. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. What do you think? What did you think, Wyra? You watched most of the playthrough. I think it was your first time watching Resident Evil, right? Resetting up OBS. Yeah, the music's the music's a little bit weird. It's good. It's the song is specifically made for the game because it's telling the tale of Village of Shadows, but it's singing it. This is the cartoon that we watched at the very beginning of the game. It's like they turned it into a song. Resident Evil turned into a Bjork and Tim Burton collab one hell tab. I wonder if this is Bjork. <laughs> this very much, very well could be Bjork actually, Jeff. That's it. I'm gonna have nightmares. Um, yeah. Maybe. This place makes my insides shake. Yeah, it's a cra it's a crazy game series, Wara. Seven is a really good game too. I might stream it again at some point. You should definitely either play it or watch it. Seven and eight are direct sequels to each other with the character Ethan Winters, the main character. Oh. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, save our daughter. So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. Even now, the, well, the uh, forest the tales is a expanded. reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Monty. Sounds a bit Bjorkish. They had a weird song in Resident Evil 7 as well. They had a very weird song. RE7 is creepy as fuck, but good. It, it is a lot scarier. It's a much scarier horror kind of game. HP Lovecraft was smoking that same shit. Maybe. I like 7 more. It was scarier and I love the story so much. 7... I mean, they're both different. They're very different games. Seven is more like a haunted house almost type story, but it's not a haunted house. It's just full of like mold zombies and crazy psychopathic hillbillies that are infected with mold and basically turn into the same, they turn into monsters similar to like this one with the four lords, except for it's like the different family members. It's really well done. Hi, Debbie. We just finished it. It's a wicked game, Debbie. Wicked. Great. I've been lurking. Uh, it was so good. The, uh, the ending was uh, pretty action-packed, but it was cool. They wrapped everything together nicely, actually. 
I was worried. I was concerned for a bit. I was like, how are they gonna end this? Like, it's so fucked. Ah, finally I can unmute you. Spoiler alert, Duke does. Nah. Duke's an OG. He's gonna show up in the next game. Which will probably take... Which will probably be Chris Redfield in the BSAA headquarters, whatever the BSAA is. Because the BSAA is probably infected with mold too. Seeing as how they were sending bioweapons or something like that. Or maybe they'll do like a throwback and they'll do like a first person... Resident Evil 9 will be like a first person... Uh story, but maybe it'll take place in more of a, re a traditional zombie type of area. Maybe they'll, I don't know, maybe you'll play as like, I don't know. I don't know how they could do nine. Uh, Chris is not in two. Chris is not in two. He was in four. I don't, he wasn't in three. Chris was in four, I think. Was it... Was it Chris Redfield in four? Ghost? Yeah, he's in five and six. Or is Leon? Oh. So Chris is only five and six? Chris was in the first one. Leon was two. Um, three I just recently played. I can't remember the name of the characters. It was Carlos and what's her name? Jill. Jill and Carlos was in was three. I didn't like four and five. I didn't like five. And I've never finished four, but I have played it. One, five, and six. So he was in the first one. I also haven't played the first one. Four and seven are probably the best. Well, Resident Evil 2 remake is probably my choice for the best one and then I think I think it goes for me it goes two and then seven play the shit out of two two is really good two was like mind-blowingly good it better not take seven years to make res 9 when did uh, well res res 7 came out in 2017 so this took, this was like three, maybe four years in the making. The evil has been resident for a while. It is unlikely, it is likely to become a full practicing doctor at some point. Potentially. It's a good, it's a good doctor joke, Jeff. I approve. You guys can have some points just for hanging out for the end credits. Here's a raffle. <laughs> I think Res 7 was 2017. Let me check real quick. You might be right, Mythics. Let me check, though. Bum, 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 bum. I'm expecting something after the credits, so that's why we're sitting here through all of this. It's January 24th, 2017. So we basically waited four years for for res for res eight. So maybe 2025? <laughs> Who knows? Maybe 2024? We'll see. Capcom seems to be uh right on the forefront of next generation, so. Felt longer than four years? It did, honestly. But I played it in 2000 and uh actually I think I did play it in 2017. I think it was August of 2017 or July or something. So I played it like seven or eight months after it came out. The moon? Nobody can touch the moon. It's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. Is that Rosemary grown up? You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels <laughs> it's got the moon shells, moon shoes. 
flowers for Ethan. Maybe we'll play as Rosemary in the next character. Maybe Rosemary will be the next main character. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Oh. I'm getting hit in the feels right now. <laughs> yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. Oh, she's got guards that like. <laughs> we have a situation. Keep tabs on her all You're day needed. long. Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa! It's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. <laughs> Stand down. We have a clear shot. Stand on it. She's just a kid. <sighs> Way to keep it together, Rose. There's just like snipers trained on her at all times too. Holy You're fuck! You're not like him, you know. I know. Enough to make grown man cry. I'm not crying, you're crying, chat. Who's that on the road? Imagine her going to school. The father's story is now done. Oh, shit. That confirms Ethan's dead, at least. I mean, <laughs> is that if that's not the closure that you need, if that's not the closure you need for Ethan, then I don't know what to tell you. Oh, I got achievement unlocked. Great dad. Best dad ever. Completion time, standard, 9 hours and 45 minutes. It's all, I'm crying, but it's probably because of Dark Souls. Oh, cool. I got all these, like, extra movies, like level design, visual development, creation of Village of Shadows. Village of Shadows full version. Oh, like the fairy tale full version. You can get the following weapon from extra content. Got for finishing the main story. Completed the following challenges. So I got 51,510 CP. We actually got... Oh, shit. Uh. Oh, yeah. Huskin. I just finished it, dude. It was so good. Oh, it was so good, dude. I loved it. It was awesome. It was, like, such a good sequel. Fucking great. So sad at the end, though. I'm sad right now. Like, I got the feels. It's Resident Evil. He'll pop back up, maybe. Instead of, like, at the end of credits, they should have had Ethan's, like, fist, like, Busting through the grass and being like zombie Ethan. That would have been cool. <laughs> I'll be playing it again on the hardest difficulty. You're gonna do Village of Shadows? Okay, now faster. What was your completion time? Uh, nine hours, 45 minutes. <laughs> Knife only, no heals. Yeah, somebody did that, Huskin, already. Somebody has already speedrun the game with just a knife and no healing. Oh no, a night map with fog. This is not Hunt Showdown, Jeff. 